What is up Midway Mayhem fans? This is Dan and again we are checking in from SeaWorld Orlando and a little birdie has told us today may be the day that Kraken Unleashed Soft opens. We're going to head inside and check it all out. Fingers crossed. It's a little bit busy this morning but we were able to get through back check real quick and now we are about to head inside the park. And we are in. Making our way over to Kraken. Ta-da! The walls are down here at Kraken Unleashed and we have the temporary stanchions right here with employees. Nothing in terms of soft opening just yet. Fingers crossed, we may see something soon. Final preparations around the area are going on as we have this gentleman putting the ride restricted sign on saying do not cross this line, do not hop over the fence, do not cross go, that kind of thing. And right there I can see a new wait sign showing how long the wait is for Crack and Unleashed. And check this out guys, we have a train on the lift right now, doing a little testing. And I believe I see an employee on there right now. That's a good sign. Even the old Kraken sign has a new overlay right there. More and more employees are showing up at the entrance, another good sign. checks and all that other stuff so it will not be open all day Hi. so we're gonna let a number of people come through ride it and then you have to leave and then yeah. we're open again throughout the day that's it okay. for the ride there's no bags at all so you have a, if you have a fanny pack a purse a backpack anything like that you have to leave it with a non-rider or leave it in a locker okay, okay? Um, hats glasses all that will not be able to ride as well because of the virtual gear so if you have those things it'd be fastest if you just leave that with a non-rider then you don't have to worry about checking that in the, in the loose article bin and all that. Okay? So we're going to do it very orderly. Please do not run. All right? We're going to be safe first. And then we're going to just count off the number of guests that we're going to let this first run. And you guys have a good time up there, all right? Okay. Everyone excited? Yeah! yeah. Okay. Cool. Hey, guys, One. Hi, uh, right, guys. What do you need to I said to I don't know. Woo, thank you guys. Must be secured, left with a non or placed in a locker. Thank you. So, right off the bat, there's all sorts of new paint. And you can smell the paint too. New signage. More like caution. It looks like we're uh, almost in a scuba tank area, like a marine research center. The new doors over here and paneling. We have a giant TV up there now as well. And here we go. We are almost in the station. This ride of experimentation creates forces and speeds that may not be acceptable to some guests. 
It may cause injury to some riders. Two. Alrighty guys, so we are here on Kraken Unleashed. We're about to get our first ride. We have Brett right next to me, and we're about to put on the headset. So we have the headset already in the bag. And it's gonna go on. It has the headphones and everything. If you don't mind, sir. Yep, go ahead and don it. Okay. Now you can pull your ear. Is that good tightness wise? Yes, awesome. very. Okay, Just pull this up. Slide right over. Oh yeah. There we go. Oh, wait, look for it, Dan. There we go. Awesome. All right, so the VR just got turned on, and first thing that we notice is it looks like, yeah, we're in a launch bay. I see launch bay alpha. There's track in front of us. And there's Sea World like logos all over the place, this giant kind of reactor. And it looks really neat. The R system looks very clear. There is a speedometer in front of us. We're in like some sort of vehicle. But yeah, everything looks good so far. And we're gonna try it out in just a second. And here we go. place. Yeah, dolphins. There's a submarine vehicle over here. This is actually really clear. Like the VR system looks very nice. Graphics as well look very good. There's all sorts of stuff happening around us. So there's lots to look at. And I think we're getting close to the top now. Yep, here we are. And there we go. So I'm impressed with the VR system. Graphics look amazing. Story, there was too much to really tell what was happening. Uh, your headset. But overall, decent experience. Brett, what did you think? It was awesome. You really liked it? Yeah. Yeah. I'm fascinated. Yeah, graphics are great. I will say that my headrest wasn't on, my harness, uh, I mean, the headset wasn't on as tight as I wish it would have been because it started coming off a little bit. But uh, overall, not bad. And now we're back to the blank screen as we're sitting on the transfer track. So we're coming into the station now, I think. Woo! Welcome back, guys. All right, as our operators are going to clean your headsets, we asked if you could hold them out for us so we can sanitize the headset and get that process going. 
Thank you guys for experiencing crack and at least hopefully you enjoyed your ride. Well, at least a little bit of the old ride is still here at the photo booth. The old Kraken right there. So we have entered the cavern where the Kraken eggs used to be and unfortunately they're gone and they're not going to be returning either. We do have the tentacle that extends down into here now. That looks nice, but yeah, no more eggs for the Kraken. So yeah, soft openings are very intermittent. As we can see, we got in, but this giant group of people behind us are not getting in. From what we hear, it's only gonna be a couple hundred per hour. That's all right though. Alrighty guys, so we just got off the ride, Brett and myself. We were literally first train, front row, first ones to try it out. Brett, what'd you think? I thought it was good. Um, the quality of the video was really good. Just a few things I need to work on is with the headset. The headset kept flying off and I had to hold it a couple times. But other than that, maybe the wait time is going to be a little long in the future, you know, but pretty good ride. Now, you said you've never done VR before? No, never. Okay, so how would you say this is a good one or a bad one in terms of, like, first experience? First experience, I think it's great. But would I wait two, three hours? No, I would never do that. But no. it's a great experience. I would recommend trying it out, obviously. Yeah, I really enjoyed it. Graphics were great. Uh, they're right on par with some of the other VR uh, companies out there and other rides. I won't say that I like it more than the others because honestly, it's right there with all of them. Uh, scale of one to 10 though, I would honestly give it maybe an eight to an eight and a half. It's a good experience. I like the fact that you can do this and you don't have to do VR, uh, but definitely low times are gonna be a little slow. But again, today is the first day for these employees to do the soft opening and everything. So they're just learning. So it'll take a little time, but that is gonna do it for our review of Kraken Unleashed. We got to do it first time. So of course we're gonna have more updates from here. So if you like what we do, Follow us on Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, and Twitter at Midway Mayhem, and I will see you out on the Midway.